Now Lincoln's game is reprising fine design, premium interiors, and exemplary performance for prosperous customers beckoned by more than a dozen import and domestic makers. The US is ground zero, with a few exports to China where the Lincoln brand still commands respect. After witnessing Audi, BMW, and Mercedes-Benz bloody Cadillac and sales in the sports sedan category, Lincoln is taking a pass on that fight for now. Establishing exterior dimensions that are a touch grander in every direction than a Mercedes E-Class has enabled Lincoln design chief David Woodhouse to sculpt the Continental with nicely flowing lines and voluptuous proportions. The new face of Lincoln is a Bentley-esque grille shared with the facelifted MKZ and slated to replace the bow wave motif throughout the brand's lineup. Another lapse in creativity is the racetrack tail lamp theme long used by Dodge and seen on both past and fresh and MKZs. At least there's beauty in the details. Substantial body forms and gentle creases showcase the Continental's wheels and tires. There are just enough badges and insignias to reveal this car's identity. Our favorite feature is the side window trim finished in a polished silver hue that neatly integrates thin mirror pedestals and substantial door handles with the belt line. While skateboarders will surely be tempted to grab those inviting loops for a tow, their intended purpose is to elevate the entry experience. A light touch on their inside surface activates a micro switch that unlatches the door electrically. Spring pressure initiates the opening swing, and other mechanisms ease the final closing and latching effort. This ambitious reinvention of the door handle suggests that Lincoln may finally be serious about clearing the skepticism cloud in this brand. Interior designers took excellent advantage of the Continental's sprawling 117.9 inch <laughs>